it going, everybody? Today is Thursday. It's day number 53 of the 100-day challenge. I'm feeling good. I'm focused. I'm ready to get this day knocked out. All is well over here. And I am back with another excerpt from the book. Um, I definitely like the book. It's definitely a good reference. Dr. Alan Lewis is good with me. Um, one of the excerpts I want to put from the book where he talks about, without giving the too much away in the book he pretty much talks about skipping days skipping days meaning um not eating for the day that you're supposed to have your bites like a day you know when it's time for you to eat you decide to just skip your meal and keep going and and fast for an extended amount of time um, I'm a fan of that. I've done a lot of research on extended fasting, and when you're a person with a lot of body mass, a lot of body fat like I have, um, it definitely maximizes your benefits as far as to fast for extended amounts of time. Now, this is something that you might have to crawl with before you walk because a lot of people are barely fathoming the idea of fasting for 24 hours, 22 to 24 hours a day. So I would say this is a bit of advanced five bite dieting if you will but um all the research is there the doctor talks about it in the book someone asks hey what what about skipping meals do you recommend that and he's like yeah sure go for it skip meals if you can do it skip them um what it does is burns more fat because you're fasting for an extended amount of time and it shortens which in turn shortens your uh the steps on your destination like you know with you having maximize fat burning then it makes your journey a little shorter by that much so he stands by behind it i stand behind it i've done it from experience and um there's like i said there's a lot of literature out there and there's definitely um some different things that come into play once you start to fast between the 24 48 72 hour range now like i said this is something crawl with before you walk try it at your own discretion I'm speaking from my personal experience of how my body reacts to it. I have a lot of fat on my body, so that's a lot of stored energy that can compensate for me missing a meal. So another thing that I want to do because I want to make this five by diet a lifestyle or just a healthy lifestyle in far as my health and eating and making sure that I'm making up for one post post challenge is what I'm talking about. Once I'm off of this challenge, I definitely want to go into maintenance i won't be at my desired weight but i will be going right back at it and um one of the things that i want to do i want to start implementing protein shakes like a pro one protein shake a day and make sure that it has everything that i need in it and uh, you know just do that once a day and gradually move from bites to pro to a protein shake a day and uh slowly start to gradually implement working out cardio just make it a lifestyle because you know a lot of people like this is if you're on a diet you're doing this you're you have a journey you have a destination you have a desired weight loss once you get to that desired weight loss you don't want and that you don't want to over eat once you lose the weight that you need to lose and that's another thing that the doctor says in the book if you're going to skip a day do not make up for it for the bites that you missed it defeats the purpose, you know, and that's just pretty much common sense that when you skip that day and then you say, okay, well, I'm going to have 10 bites because I missed two bites. I missed my bites yesterday. It's defeating the purpose. So um, that's all I have today. And uh, I hope you're getting some, some success on your diet. I hope that you're making those changes that you need to make. You're burning that fat. You're losing that weight you need to lose. And, you know, you are influencing the people around you to lose weight because they see the changes in you you're doing something outside of the box by losing weight and a lot of people just accept their weight and that's not you because you know about the diet and you watch this channel and you're a part of these groups and you are very concerned with their weight so it's only a matter of time before it clicks and you'll be off to the races so i'll see you tomorrow